Hey guys, and welcome back to Europa Universalis 4 as the Republican Castile. We are setting up to go to war with these douchebags. Uh, yep, you go there, and um, we need one army in Auvergne. There you go, and then we can just chain siege all of their land. And then you can go into Aragon if they jump into the war. Bish, bash, bosh, job is a good one. How are we doing with this? Yeah, we're still ahead on both of these guys, so we don't need to worry. Uh, Castile, Papal State and Portugal's taking over those. Good, Burgundy doesn't have anyone for if one of their men die, so that's good. And we've got a shit ton of people influence just sitting. Hey, integration's a slow process. Oh, well, there's Republican tradition. Uh, let's maintain the guy there. Okay. We can build provincial improvements. I don't want to build treasuries, they're just regiment costs down. As well build counting houses. We don't have anywhere because the buildings are still all getting built. So that's, we need to wait on our diplomat finishing here so we can go to war with them. The only allied with Tunisia. That is great. Oh, we've got six men here. Alright, okay. I suppose you can join up with these nine men that we're about to get as well. Oh, eventually. Fucking hell. Alright, so we want to grab these men from Alexandria and bring them over. I've got Wawa to lose. And we'll just annex... Eh, sorry, Tunisia. And um, we'll just annex Tunisia. Annex... Eh, sorry. We'll annex Tunisia. Oh no, we don't have cores on it. We will vassalize Tunisia, vassalize Toulouse, vassalize Aragon, vassalize whoever else gets fucking grabbed into the war. Really. I reckon it'll just be um, Toulouse and Tunisia, though, to be fair. We'll just vassalize them all. Vassalize everyone! Tripoli's allied with Tunisia, but that's it, basically. And they're all Catholic, which I find just extremely hilarious. <laughs> you can see, Catholic! Catholic everywhere! <laughs> Orthodox! <laughs> wow, Coptic down here. Animists. Sunnis? Wow, okay, Mali, I didn't know you were converted to Sunni. Jeez. Right, let's pick up these men and to the boats. To the boats. There we go. And drop them off in an Anaba. There we are. Move you guys to Constantine. And as soon as we get the uh, the CB on these guys, we shall jump on their faces. Let's jump up to speed 4. Right, how's it going down here, Austria? How are you doing? Not too shabby, eh? How's your war score? Oh, you're at war with the world now. That's dangerous for you guys. I really want to go to war with Savoy, but Savoy, uh Oh, they're at war with Savoy. Oh no, that's a papal state I've clicked on. You idiot! Okay. Never mind then. Papal state's getting fucking big, look at that! They're doing alright for themselves. They could actually form Italy soon. <laughs> oh wow, Burgundy own land down here. Jeez, Burgundy. Calm down. The fuck? So the coalition of Baden. An alliance law from Tunisia. Sorry, Tunisia. You said war with France? Oh, obviously because Toulouse is at war with France. Sorry, Tunisia, but um Your Alliance offer's gotta be rejected, buddies. Portuguese Patriots. There we go, move you guys there and then back. No thanks, Tunisia. Thanks, though. But no thanks. Alrighty. There we go. That's that war done. What's our max vampire? Oh, it is 152k. Fair enough. So that's fine. We've got the three armies here just to go straight on to the, uh, the lands. Whenever we get the CB. 80%. Almost done. Oh, we've got an election. 
If we keep the guy, we'll lose Republican tradition, but we don't have an awful lot of Republican tradition, so let's go for another bureaucrat. Crat. So we can get more admin points, because that's the tech that we're behind on right now. No, we'll also need to get some, uh, we'll need to swap over to the Diplo guy. Because we do have a Diplo idea that we need to go for. So we might have to go for that as well. Yeesh. Hey, we've gained a CB on Toulouse, let's just double check. Yep, they're only allied with Tunisia. Declare war, take Langdo. We don't need any allies. Okay, let's you there, you there, and you there. And Tunisia haven't joined in yet, but they will. There we go. Move you guys down here. Oh, Tunisia. Where's your army? There we go, we'll just do that, and everyone's on all the land that we need to be on. And then that's that. Well, that was interesting. <laughs> that was an easy fight. Let's put it that way. And then hopefully, if I vassalize them, I should jump into the war against Provence. If I remember rightly, uh, against Provence, against France. Gold is a sign of nobility! Nobility cannot be bought, gentlemen. We gain far more gold than we actually need. There we go, there's another one for us. Uh, yeah, Burgundy is lucky that none of their men died. It was one of ours that died and we got another one. Or none of the other guys died. Oh, we've won the siege of Rougerou already. So I drop you guys into Auvergne. How's the rest of this going? Fine. I have no idea where Tunisia's army is. 14, 5 and 7. Here's 8, 2 and 4. So they do have an army somewhere. Where it is. I don't fucking know. Hopefully they don't come and attack me because that would be silly of them. I mean, if they don't come and attack me, I vassalize them to keep their army. Tariffs on wool. Tax it. So, like, don't attack me. It's your best bet, guys, really. Logically, it is. And don't finish your war either, because I'll be very upset if you do that. Uh, select province, who are you? It is just France that they're at war with. It's 66%. I have to siege down all these lands before it happens, though. We've won that siege. I'm going to keep the men there. They, they aren't taking an awful lot of... Uh, Attrition, so I'm not too bothered about it. There we go, the Siege of Toulouse is over. I think they're fully defensive. Yeah. That's fine. I can move you guys into Rousselon, though. And you guys up to Dauphine, so that they don't come to try and attack us. I'll actually move you guys to Auvergne. How's that not at 100%? Do they have more land? To lose? Do you have more land to lose? No, you don't. Oh, I don't understand why it's not 100%. Um, what? I, do, I don't get it. The war exhaustion is low. They don't have any provinces. I, I don't know if it's still because... Who's this? What the hell? Yeah, go home while you're, while you're at war, you dingus. Jeez, are you an idiot? So, sorry, that's my uh, my trade fleet. There we go, that siege is over. Let's move them here. Let's actually send you guys here to speed up these. Won the siege of Jerba. Group you guys together and send you up here. Then that's the last siege that we need to do. We'll piece out Tunisia separately. Oh, I didn't realise that the game was still paused. God. 35%. Oh, 56% now. These guys are surrounded. They're not allowed to leave. 
And we've won the Siege of Tunis. So let's grab Tunisia. Sue for peace. Castilian vassal. Ah, we don't have the um, the diplo points for it. You know what? I'm going to I'm going to have to stop this annexation here. Can we not stop the annexation? You come back. Yes, okay. You've been there for fucking ages. I realise it, and I've just wasted a load of diplo points. But I need diplo points. Toulouse will siege, seed, rather, a load of places. I'll send you guys there, send you guys up to Anaba. No, I need to get enough that I can vassalize both of you, because I completely forgot about it. It only cost me 50, so how much do we get? We get 5 a month, so 10 month, and we should have it. Let's uh, send you guys to protect trade in Sevilla again, but to go home while at war. There we go. God, now we just need to wait on Diplo power ticking up. Savoy's cancelled the military accents, fine. Peace off from Tunisia. They want to seed land to us. I don't want that, I want you to be a vassal. Be my vassal, baby. Oh, one fucking case of all just died. That sucks. Why won't they accept that? Length of war. Ah, that makes no sense. It's like, oh my god, the war's too long. The war's, the war's too short, rather. Even though I've completely and utterly sieged them down, they're like, nope, the war is far too short. Peace off from Toulouse. Nah, I don't want you to seed places. I want you to be my vassal. Baby. I want you to take away my pain. I want you to stand by me forever. You can't take my breath away. <laughs> now we're actually... We're going to be waiting on them being able to accept it. Never mind us being able to send it. One more month, though. Oh, we can get a new idea. Oh, it's admin. Ooh. Obviously, we want the tech first because it gives uh, production efficiency up 10%. I will stand by you forever. God, that song's going to be stuck in my head for the rest of the day. I hate it. Oh, one more month. And tick. There we are. Good job, gents. Be my vassal, baby. There we are. Now we just need to wait on Toulouse becoming my vassal. Which is going to cost me another 50. Ah, we've got enough men anyway. Aragon's declared war on the Papal State. Probably not the best idea there, Aragon. Who are you allied with? Oh, Burgundy and Portugal. Okay, Papal State's fucked. Yeah, Aragon and Burgundy. Portugal didn't join in though. Oh, we got the other freebie. Fair enough. Soon we'd be able to take that guy off the Papal State, which would be interesting. Yes, Pope, you may have military access through my lands. That's funny because they've got no money, their men are just slowly deteriorating. Well, it's not funny because I've got to be my... Uh, my vassal as soon as I've got 50 fucking diplo power. Augsburg, sure. To lose, no, piss off. We just need to wait on the uh, the power. I'll just speed 5 it. Oops, sorry Brunswick. Reduce the trade investment or I'll lose my- ooh. Let's lose the diplo power. Unfortunately, <laughs> I didn't want to. Oh, and three, two, one, and they pieced out. You dirty fuckers! You bastards! They must have just lost so much money.
Um, let us support those rebels for like pennies. There we are. Are you 50 diplo pearl? Jesus Christ. I need a way to get 50 diplo pearl. Sharpish. Oh, we actually. Guyanese nationalists. I'm sending those guys to just sit in Gascoigne. Uh, they would lose their desire, so let's do that. Let's keep them. Lost a fair amount of men there, but it doesn't make much difference. Scotland almost cancelled the right to military access. We can get the admin tech. Oh god. Alright, let's send you there. You there, and you there. We'll sort out these rebels because we can't support them right now. There we go. Should probably get a leader in charge of one of these armies, but it doesn't make much difference. We're only losing manpower on a slight amount of money, and money, as you can probably tell by now, is not a prime concern of mine. In another two months we'll be able to vassalize these. Oh, great man, our employees died. Great. Oh no, it was this guy. Let's grab another level two. There we go, just so that we got the, uh, the ten. Castilian vassal. Zero negatives. There we go, this accepted a generous offer. And those rebels just disappeared. Perfect. Alright, let's send you guys down to... We have the revolt, the little revolt risk map mode up again. Where the fuck is it? That's coalition. Revolt risk. Ah, oh, none. And the only revolt risk is around here and on Alexandria because it's still uh, converting. Let's ditch that. Um, let's have a look at our diplomatic relationships. Oh, a five out of seven. Fuck me. Alright, so that's that done. Truces, uh, our truce with France expired. Hmm, interesting. Oh, they're in the coalition against me. Who else is in the coalition against me? Anyone? No, just France. Haha. -ha. <laughs> Fuck you, France. You're getting stomped. Alright, guys, but with that, we're going to call an episode. So, as always, thanks a lot for watching. Do remember, I've been CJ. You've been awesome. I'll see you next time.